um, I found this cool thing, um, so if you get, if you get, so see the box, the, here, this box is not there, see that? So how I did that is that, oh, and also, um, that's like, this right here is pure, um, it's just, like, talent of, a uh, yeah, um, so, um, what I use this for is what I use this for, um, so the erase feature right here, um, I clicked on that, so you obviously have to, um, put in two, um, two of them, two um, pictures, so I took one with, with the box, and one without the box, and yeah, this is my first ever, um, tutorial, so, um, this is, so, that, that's the first tip I wanted to show you, so, um, how I got that idea, oops, how I got that idea was from a video I just made, you'll, you'll see it pop up on my YouTube channel soon, this so when i was animating this i found out this because so see how this car it's um shiny and how it's like a mirror so i i don't i still have to edit this um so see how my finger is right there on the car but isn't there i'm still gonna fix this don't worry it's not gonna be um bad um that's how I found that out. So, yeah. And I'm going to show you another tutorial. Here, let's see. So, um, if you have stop motion, this is fine with you. Um, I mean, fine for... This is good for that. So, um... So, see this right here? I didn't, I didn't bother to use the... The face. I didn't bother to use this. I mean, so you then you could do three. I'm actually pretty. This I'm actually pretty surprised how. What did the? Okay, so I'm actually surprised how this works. Um, I just learned about it a few days ago how it actually works. So um, in I don't think I posted this yet. So it's a box. Um, just regular. So, see right here, on one of these frames, right there, right here, that's, I use the eraser effect. The eraser effect can do so many things. Oh, come on. I hope I didn't post that. I really need to fix that. The eraser effect um, can do a lot of stuff um, like that. Um, and I'm going to move on to my next one. See you in a bit. So, well, um, not see you in a bit. Um, this is, this was when one of my friends were over. Um, here. See how right here, there's nothing right there. There's nothing right there. There's nothing right there. Then there's nothing right there. And nothing right there. Because I use the eraser effect. So I'm going to try and find another thing that I could do a tutorial on. I mean, I like doing stop motion. It's one of my favorite hobbies. Oh, and also, I'm very glad we have this um little thing. Special effects. Man, that helped me. Um, but I don't really do, like, special that. And also facial expressions. That's what helped me with um, the faces. Um, I watched this. I don't... I didn't watch the young boy or the table of elements. So, um, I'm so glad they updated, um, stop motion studio. So let me, um, get to the new tutorial. Well, the next piece. I found it out. The smoke effect. So it's in this one right here. So if you see right here, so see right here when he rolls very fast. So what I used is a very well edited um, audio.
this is this is the tire squeal and i mean this is very well edited i was surprised that i could actually do it so i used um the tire squeal with the punch here's the punch um the punch sound not like a punch um and it's like uh um so i used the where did it go oh right yeah i built on i bailed on that one so I believe I used it on this one. Yep, right here. The tire, t the smoke effect. So I seen this a while back. Um, when you have this, um, just keep adding more fog and put some fog on the wheel so it looks like it's squealing. With, um, I didn't put in the sounds yet. Um, I still need to do that. Um, with the tire, with the tire, um, skid. It says car skid. Um, car is what you should add for the sound. Um, and also, ooh, 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 ooh. So when you're animating with a car, this is the next one. Um, when you're animating with a car, so you see that wheel right there. So if you um, measure half of it, put it, make it go forward half a wheel, then every so often, so. Make it go forward half a wheel, half a wheel, one wheel. Th so you know what I'm talking about. If you know what I'm talking about, then, um, yeah. Um, then every so often, um, add one wheel, then go to half a wheel, then go to one wheel. Then when you're going to go to faster, go to two wheels. Then you get, um, then you get this. Then you get this. I also made... I also made one with the sound. So right here. See it? See right there? How that works? So if I didn't have that um that burnout right there, um then then you would have been able to see it. So see how it goes like a bit faster every so often. So like I go so at the beginning you do half a wheel, remember, or like less than a half a wheel. Then you do after that wheel. Wait, did I do? Oh, I did an entire wheel for the start. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Oh wait. No no no, I did less than half wheel. Okay, good. I thought I messed up. And this is what it looks like. Yeah, see what I said? This is the one I found out how to do that cool little um, effect. I can't, why do I keep accidentally clicking on stuff? And also, I couldn't, I'm surprised because I got 38 subs now. Um, so, when did, did I make this? Did I make this? I don't remember making this. Oh, now I remember. Yeah, I'm, I was I wasn't that great back then. Okay. Um. Well. Yes, I was. So there's I I'm was an amateur back then. Yeah, I remember this. I remember this definitely. When someone. Huh. Oh yeah, this failed. I didn't post this. Wait, ten FPS. Oh. Yeah, it doesn't look that great. I might delete it. Okay, so. I'm going to my file. So, here, let's see. What could I do next? Right, you know the erasing effect? I didn't use it in this one because it was short. Um, I should have. Wait, no, I didn't even post that. Never mind. This short got like 5k views. I was so surprised. Five K views just from that. Oh yeah, I, I made this him jumping out of the car. Um when someone was here. Um okay, so huh. Well, you guys tell me what you want to learn, like, if there's anything you want to know, 
about stop motion. Oh, and also, I do I did this. So like, see this. So if you go here, edit. There's all the body parts. It's just that they're um they're not they're transparent. So if you go format, if you go to opacity, I put at opacity. I put at zero. Then I then I start with the leg. Then I go to then the leg right there is the brightest one. It's not going to be the most um, clear. Then everything goes to at a certain point here. Yep, right there. Then two two frames. So let's see. If you put on 15 frames a second, man, it looks it's like a disco ball. Look at this. Wait, what? Oh. Just put it at max frames a second. It's... Yep, exactly. <sighs> okay, I get this weird feeling when, like, something goes fast. Like, too fast for me, or, like, how small. See how that looks so big now, right, right there? That was so tiny, and that just makes me feel weird when it's, like, a screen. So. What was that? Um, so. This is my step motion. Um... So how I figure out how to do this, but so yeah, um, tell me if you want to learn anything. I mean, I feel like I have enough experience with stop motion. Um, I had to re, I had to do some things, and I did so much more stop motion videos. Sometimes I delete them to save space. You know how I am. Well, no one knows how I am. They haven't. Okay, so. Yeah, um, I'm going, I'm going to post this soon. Or have I? I don't remember. I'm going to figure that out. Um, so without further ado.